Hello everyone, welcome to Sex Questions and Paddles. This is your girl Lauren Mathis. Uh, welcome to my channel where we talk about all uh, well, all grown and sexy things and why. Um, if you all are new to my channel, let me introduce myself and tell you all about me and this channel and what we do. Um, again, welcome to Sex Questions and Paddles. I am your girl Lauren Mathis. I am a certified uh, sexologist and a love coach and also I am a well, a, a wine business owner. I am an independent consultant with Wine Shop at Home, and I am also the creator of Love Story Mobile Winery. And on this channel, we talk about everything from you know, said love, romance, dating, um, relationships, um, grown and sexy conversations, sex, um, marriage enrichment, and we talk about all great wine, right? And so I bring this, well, I bring you all something to my page like two or three times a month. I try to, well, two or three times a month where we talk about, like I said, all things love and wine, right? Those are the two greatest combinations, love and wine. Can't get no better than that. So if you all are new to my channel, thank you all. I want you all to do me a favor. I want you all to hit the like, subscribe button and um, notification button so you all can, you know, be notified every time I upload a, a new video, okay? So you all won't be missing anything good all right so let's get our drinks together stir it up take a sip and get into it all right so today i am bringing you all five amazing bottles now as you all know i bring you all well this month i brought you all two old goody and um i brought you all three new bottles of wine okay and so this is I prepare uh, like this is the beginning of the holiday season, and this is my little care package that I am sending <laughs> or I'm giving to you all um to get you all ready for Thanksgiving because it's right around the corner, right? So we're going to talk about these amazing wines. I'm going to tell you which will pair well, well with your uh, uh, with the turkey or with your sweet potato pie or with your pumpkin pie or whatever you got going on on the table. Whatever your spread is, all of these wines that I have for you, um, they will go they'll pair well and perfect with them. And uh, let's get things started. So, today we're gonna start off with a newbie. As you all see, it's called a Joy Wine. So, the Joy Wine is an amazing collection um, that I was introduced uh, when I started in this with last year. And, um, this is our, our holiday collection, right? And so Joy Wine, they have an amazing blend. Like I said, they have amazing reds and whites. And I fell in love with the wine. And then when they came out this year, this season, with a Pinot Noir, I was immediately ready, able, happy, and ready to just explore my options, right? And just taste the wine. So... So I clicked on it and I got it as soon as possible. And when it came in, oh my gosh, this wine was everything that I thought it would be, that I needed. It was just so, so, so yummy. So let's talk about Joy Wine. So Joy Wine, this is a 2018 seller's wine. And this is the Pinot And um, this wine um, is amazing and it will go well with, um, it will go well with your turkey, actually. Um, it will go with like your, your sausage stuffing. Um, if you're doing a vegan sausage stuffing, it will go well with that. Um, it will go well with your ham. Um, it would just, it, it, will, it will just complement actually the entire dish. If you're doing a green, so if you're doing a Brussels sprouts casserole, whatever your heart's desire, it will just go amazing and well. And this is actually, um, this is actually a great appetizer wine. It's perfect. It's 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 a nice dry wine, but it hits the it, it just hits your taste buds also right. It is perfect in every way, and, so, and that's actually what I'm drinking on now. But like I said, I love the wine so much. I had last month I had bought me three. This month I had bought me two, and I'm telling you, it is amazing and perfect in every way. The next wine I'm going to show you is 
It's a newbie wand, but it's actually not so new. Well, it's it's a newbie wand. Um, this is a new collection that came out, and it's a sweet wine um, that came out back in. It was I think it was September, September of yeah, it was September of this of twenty twenty, and this is a suburb a a, 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 a suburban fracas, a millet fracas, and this is a twenty nineteen Lodi millet, and this is a white sweet wine. Okay, so let's talk about this little beauty right here. She is a white wine, and she is every bit of amazing okay um i fell in love with her she is very crisp she is very sweet she is very melony she is very easy on the palate and she just brings a lot of floral and citrus into your taste buds and just give you a happy dance in your mouth she is perfect in every way i think that she like i said all sweet wines go with your desserts okay and so she will go Perfect with your pumpkin pie or your sweet potato pie or your sweet potato souffle or um, your pumpkin pie or, or your spiced or carrot cake or your upside down cake. She will go and also your apple, um, your apple pies. She will go well with each and every dessert that you are uh, laying on the table this uh, well uh, or this holiday or this Thanksgiving um, um, season. And also, she is goes great. I don't know if, how many people serve um, seafood, but she will go great with some seafood gumbo. She will also go well with a seafood scampi. She will, or um, a seven seas for the ones who are coming. You know the um, the the seafood lovers who you know celebrate um, who do a seafood a seafood dish during the holiday season. Uh, she will go well for. Um, our non-traditional uh, or pescatarians who like to have fish or whatever on, on your holiday table. She is just oh so fresh and lush and just a breath of love in your mouth, right? So that is our 2019 Lore Mele. Now our next wine that I'm bringing, um, I already have a bottle open in the house. I am in love with her. Um, and yes, each one I call them her. Okay. Um, <laughs> so um, this one is called Jimmy Sellers. And this is a 2019, as I showed you all before, a 2019 Merlot, a Lodi Merlot. Oh, I forgot to tell you all the alcohol percentage on the wine. So, and we'll just, um, the, Pen and wall. This is the alcohol percentage on the, the pen and wall. I'm sorry. Uh, the alcohol percentage on the pen and wall. It's a dry wine and it is. I think my pictures. The alcohol percentage is 13% in, in the um, pen and wall. And the Lodi Melee. Um, the alcohol percentage is 13.8. And. As we go into our new wine, the Jimmy Sellers, um, 2019, the alcohol percent on this is 14%. This is a very young Merlot. This is for the dry lovers. The dry lovers will fall in love with this wine. Again, this wine will go well with your hearty dishes, but it will also, it's a, it's a great compliment because usually when I do a tasting, I start off with the reds. So we start off with the reds and then we start off with the whites, right? And so this will, this wine will wake in your taste buds. She is amazing in every way. She is very, she is a dry wine. She's a young, uh, uh, she's a young Merlot. You will taste the tannins and you will taste the fruits. You will also taste the, the dark berries in the dark fruits in the wines it, it will waken up your uh, it will waken you up in every way this wine is a medium body wine and it is perfect on your it will go perfect on your dinner table so let's now on to our fun wine well all of our wines are fun but the extra fun wines and i'm saying the extra fun wines because it's the sparkling wines 
and the sparkling ones are have a special place in my heart. These wines, like I said, is the Eau de Vigne. Mm -hmm. Um This is one of my favorites, of course. If you all know me, you all know each and every wine tasting um, or wine review that I do, I always bring in my rosé. So this is Le Cadu Sparkling Rosé. This is every bit of amazing. It's one of my favorite wines. Oh, she's just so divine. Um, this is a dry red. I mean, well, this is a dry rose. So you know there's a different, you know, a difference of the roses, right? So you can have your dry roses and you can have your sweet roses. This is a dry, but it is a well-balanced rose. And it is perfect in every way. And so um, you will serve this. You would chill this and serve it extra cold. You put it into your, you put it into the ice box or your, you know, um, your wine cooler, or well, your wine, uh, your wine refrigerator an hour before. You uh, you chill it before an hour, and you serve and have a fabulous time. I would say that you serve this after everyone's meal, um, because the bubbles it just cools you up, and it's just oh, it's it's just so amazing, and it's a great celebration wine, right? Because it's the end of 2020 and we've had a whole lot going on this year, right? And we need any and everything to help us celebrate and get us started and just celebrate life. Because life is precious, right? So why don't we have, why don't we share and celebrate life uh, over a bottle of Le Cadu Rosé. Okay, so as you all know, the Le Cadu Rosé uh, uh, collection is one of my favorite collections. Of sparkling wines, and so I know last month I had introduced you all. If you go back to the um, uh, uh, we'll go back to the wine review that I did before. Um, I introduced you all to Le Cadu Rose Brut. Uh, well, no, not bro, uh, Rose, Le Cadu, um, a uh, uh, Brut sparkling wine, and that is our uh, uh, that is our dry uh, a uh, dry sparkling wine. But today I'm introducing you another. Um, one, uh, another sparkling wine of the Lacadou uh, collection or family, and this is the Lacadou sparkling white wine. And this collection, is, this is the Simosaco. Now, I am in love. I am in love with all of our Simosaco wines. Now uh, we do personalized Simosaco wines um, as well, but this wine is just. Super amazing. Like I said, she's light, she's airy, but she, she just bubbles and fills you up. She is a celebratory wine. Uh, I love her. I can't wait to open her up. Um, oh, I forgot to tell you what wine percentage, right? So the alcohol percentage in this is 12% and the rosé. And the alcohol percentage in this one is 12% as well. And so I'm going to read a little bit about it. And it says, a semi-seco sparkling wine. It's a California, all, well, all these wines are California wines. And it's vented and bottled by Wine Shop at Home and Artisan Wines in Lodi, California. And now this is an amazing wine or sparkling wine. I'm telling you, this is every, uh, it's just beautiful in every way. And so, um, Again, I will serve this at the end of the day or the or the end of the the evening to celebrate life with your friends and family if you're gonna be with friends and family or just even celebrating life just with yourself. Um just open that bottle, pop your bottle, and just love on yourself because life is beautiful and life is precious. And I just think that every day is a celebration. Why not enjoy it? I'm gonna glass with like I do. So that is going to be the end of today. Um, for what end of today's uh, review. I'm going to try to come back on here this week. I think I'm going to do a dessert pairing. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll try to do a dessert pairing with you all this week. Please don't charge me to it. I'm going to really, really try because I'm cooking. But like I said, I'm a wife and a mother of seven. And so 
um mommy gotta cook <laughs> and get it started in the kitchen so um maybe you know what maybe i'll bring you all in the kitchen with me and show y'all how i do things right so um tell me comment down below and let me know if you all would like um a lifestyle video and how i prepare um thanksgiving um for my family of seven and also bring the wine to you all so um comment down below tell me all how you feel um also um let you all know that i am available well, love story mobile winery is available for your very own uh, wine tasting uh well virtual wine tasting holiday special okay and so you all can go to my website www.wineshopathome.com and um we will uh, well go to my website you all can book a party with me there or you all can go to facebook me a facebook me forward slash love story mobile winery all one word um and you can book a party with me there um i am excited i am so grateful for this new holiday season that we have i know it's very untraditional but guess what we we made it we made it it's at the end of 2020 and we have to celebrate life and just pay it forward and move forward in the blessings and love that 2021 has to offer right we all deserve it so um with all that being said happy holidays to me to me and my family on to you and you all have a beautiful day and if no one has told you that they love you today i love you have a blessed day on purpose Bye.